Hey everyone, I'm Ken Weatherman. I'm the electric operations manager for the town of Apex Electric Department. I've been working with power for 34 years. And today we're going to be talking about the electric transformer. Transformer is a, an electrical device that transforms high voltage into a usable household 120, 240 voltage. And you can't miss them unless they're covered up with landscaping like this. So let's talk about why this is problematic. First of all, I can't see the transformer. So if there's an outage in your area, I might drive right by this location. All these plants prevents this transformer from cooling itself. All this organic material is scratching it. It's causing it to rust. It's uh, inviting insects and little critters going inside this transformer. I need space to work. There's 13,200 volts inside this transformer. These plants act as a conductor of electricity. It can't touch anything in this compartment or me while there's work being done. We require 10 feet in front of our transformer, three feet on each side of this transformer and the rear of this transformer, where none of this can be here. This is a perfect example of how a transformer is supposed to look like. I can feel that this transformer is getting the breeze it needs to uh, cool itself. Each transformer in an underground residential distribution system has its own ID tag. I can reference these numbers to a map that I have and it tells me exactly where it is on the system and I can use that information to back feed and get your power back up faster. If I can see it from the road, it makes my job a lot easier. And right here is a fault indicator. In a fault situation, these indicators will blink red and I can follow these blinking lights right to the fault and I can get your power back up faster. So why are we doing this now? We know it's planting season. We know our transformers aren't the nicest looking thing in your yard. All we're asking is that you keep us in mind for safety and reliability. Keep, keep your landscaping three feet from the sides, three feet in the back and 10 feet in front so we can have a safe working environment in case an outage occurs in your neighborhood. We're gonna be coming through in the next couple of weeks, starting in, in some of these subdivisions and doing some routine maintenance, clearing out some of these larger landscapings around our equipment to make it safe for us to work on and to provide that reliability for our customers. So thanks for watching and help us keep your power reliable by not planting landscape around our transformers.